Hello dear friends, I welcome you to Scientist Channel. In this lecture, we are going to learn about the Chem 3D. So, in this lecture, we will just learn the basics of Chem 3D. In further videos, we will go to more advanced videos and advanced level topics in chem 3d so without wasting time let's start the chem 3d we have some options on chem 3d file edit view structure calculation surface online windows and help so first of all when we click on file we have to open for a new file or open a new file you will have to click on file and this there are simple files you will have a biological some files alpha helix bacterochlorophyll beta carotenin carotenin and binding site dna insulin and a structure block and there is other measurement stereo stereo red value docking and there is an example of docking and there are some drugs and there are some inorganic materials sodium chloride crystals ice and other and there are also nanotubes so we have alpha helix like this this is alpha helix and this is the alpha helix structure this is the alpha helix structure you can move from here and you can move from this is the structure of alpha helix we can have some other examples like DNA and this is the DNA and we have other examples also to docking like this drugs we have this is a drug this is a structure of drug so after this you can open file if you have saved before and you can also import you can have a save option save as save as means that you can save a file via different file types you have here you can have a mold type other types may have a jpg like yeah there's a jpg there are a lot of types of file saving so another option we have print revert to saved you can revert it that you have saved before and print and this is a very useful module setting here module setting you can type the model type like uh, it should be wireframe or these should be sticks and these things should be a ball and sticks let's check file framework let's apply these are the file frames and there is a sticks do this these will be like a sticks and we have also ball and stick type and we have cylinder bonds let's check these are cylinder type bonds space filling bonds these are the space filling bonds and ribbons these are the ribbon types and these are ribbons. there are different types of model type you can change the type of also ligand you can give same like this giving this type and a stick type you can have a stick you can no space filling type okay and solvent method you can have solvent framework like this
and you have may have a cylinder type also solid model type then you have hydrogen atom how would you show the hydrogen atom? you can hide the hydrogen atom the hydrogen atoms will be hide and show polar you will just show the polar hydrogens in this whole molecule that you have drawn and you can also show all type of hydrogens okay now there are you can hydrogen bonds you can hide the hydrogen bonds and show intramolecular only the intramolecular are show you all these are all the lone pair you can show uh, the whole lone pairs and even you can hide so there is delocalization bond element sample you can give the elemental sample to all the uh, items and you can even show the serial number to them that are drawn here we have a color and we have alpha alex different types of colors different types of colors to these this is different color from here and you can type of <clears throat> font type and size of font and coil color alpha helix color these all these you can use element monochrome chain you can use depth element these are the elements so these group of elements you can have different colors to these all font color we have used model tabs and we have another uh, model buildings correct building rectify if you like to rectify or no you can use standard measurements so depend upon you background color you have different backgrounds color and solid background sunrise different types of background tabs you can select from here also we have another option to select use you could do two colors you can use two colors you can have an image as a background color you can use background color different types of background color can be used these are about these and the preferences you can use are preferences settings maximum RAM for external calculation it depends upon you cpu type it can be a number of cpus to be used if you have multiple cpus pictures view scale and use a scale of this picture file type giu interface window classical or other options that are interested to you <clears throat> And we have also view you can use model tab view here we have a model display display contents these are the okay we will check here so we have also here new file if you would like to have a new file then this you can draw the any structure you would like to draw let's let me draw the aniline this is the only that will be better for us and you can open other file that you want to open and if you like to save you can like to save and we have another copy you can copy this file cut save and undo and this is the parent and we have display type as we have mentioned you can use as a file type file frame and you can use sticks and even though you can use bar and stick type uh, you have other type cylinder no spacing and you can use different color of background as here mentioned as we have checked in 
air model setting so we have shortcut here you can use this type of solid background right left it depends upon you how do you use and we have another red and blue you can use red and blue type and we have other stereo chemistry okay you will show mirror image of the molecule that you have drawn it now depends upon you if you like to draw or not then we have perspective view this is the perspective view and we have other option depth fading you can use depth fading and we have option here model axis this is the y axis this is x axis and the z axis also and this is a view axis how you can view along the axis and we have atom symbols you can uh, symbols of atoms and you have also serial number to the atoms residue label if you like to label the residue you can and we have full screen f11 so this depend completely upon you at how you like to this is the way that you how can restore this and we have other options select what you like to select you can select this this is a mirror image of this you can select any of the item that you want to select you can select from here also they both way that you can select and this is translate you can translate from anywhere and we have here rotate you can rotate it this is the way that you rotate this is the way that you can rotate and we have other option zoom you can have a zoom in or out both depend upon you and move object you can move object and we have option of single bond you can create single bond now up to you and you would like to create here will it will be shown double bonds you it depend upon you that how you create double bonds position of double bonds and here we have an option of triple bond so you will create triple bonds this is that uh, how you create the triple bonds and this is the way that you can create different bonds and we have dummy bond we have also a dummy bond and eraser you can erase what you want to erase and here we have a spin you can spin the molecule this is the uh, motion of molecule how it is being spinned and we have a rock you can rock this molecule and we have axis how would like to rotate it let's this is along the axis and if you like to this is along the axis so let's along y axis and this is if you like to rotate the y axis this is being rotated by y axis the depend upon you on which axis do you want to work on that will be in a, uh, helpful for you and the, also we have another speed we have let's check the speed if i increase the speed speed let's check the movement or spinning tire speed is being increased by this and you can if you like to decrease you may want to decrease then you can let's decrease it 
very slow motion of this so it depends upon the upon you how you want to rotate it it purely depend upon you amplitude um, now depend amplitude depend upon you and we have another option amplitude how would like to use the amplitude okay you here button of stop and we have no calculation it will like uh, it uh, will alert you that whether uh, there is a uh, calculation is being done or not done and is the calculation is a running or not running heating there is a heating system cooling system heating speed whole thing this uh, depend upon the heating and non heating depends upon your calculation type what are you are um, what are you um, calculating in this km3d we will learn in more uh, videos that and we have target temperature it, there is a target temperature also thank you for watching video keep like subscribe and share my videos thank you for watching